we know that a mass of one kilogram experiences a weight force of about 10 newtons on the surface of the Earth. But for space travel, we need to know more. What's going to happen if we double the distance between our mass and the center of the Earth? For instance, what's going to happen if we double the distance between our mass and the center of the Earth? Obviously, the force is shrinking, but by which factor? It turns out that as we double the distance, we have only one quarter of the force. If we triple the distance, the force goes down to one ninth, which means that in our equation for the force of gravity, we have to have a distance squared in the denominator. If we use twice the mass, we should have twice the force, so the mass appears in the numerator. And if all masses are created equal, the mass of the Earth should have the same role. So the mass of the Earth too should appear in the numerator. From the units of measurement you can see that this doesn't work out so far. Kilograms squared divided by meters squared, that doesn't look like force. There's a universal constant appearing in front, the constant of gravity, which is 6.67 times 10 to the minus 11 newtons times square meters over kilograms squared. These units are pretty much of human scale, newtons, meters, kilograms, and you see that gravity seems to be pretty small on these scales. The force exerted by two masses of one kilogram each in a distance of one meter would amount to 6.67 times 10 to the minus 11 newtons. A pretty small force. This is why we need something as big as a planet to see gravity in action.